come. How do you react to statements that people call you a traitor? Well, my first uh, reaction is to ask them to say that in print and I'll sue them. Do so you feel that you've been a traitor to the Allies in this particular case? I've certainly not been a traitor to the Allies. You're a complete and utter liar. That is all you are. Well, I've no doubt you've come along with the intention of saying that. He called Mr. Birch a liar. It was rather an unpleasant sight in here for a few moments. You say you're not a communist, uh, where exactly do you stand politically? I stand, you know, as a journalist, I, I'm more independent than anybody in this room. Mr. Virgil, you yes. were once regarded you think as public enemy number one out? by the Americans. I know that a lot of emotions have been, uh, you know, worked up about uh, my, uh, well, uh, my activities over the past 20 years and so forth. But is it fair to say, do you think, that you were supporting the other side, the communist side? I certainly was with my articles. I mean, everything is on the record. That a man is entitled to his opinions, and to publish his opinions, and that a government has no right to deprive a citizen of his birthright. Welcome, Wilfred Burchett. Welcome your intention to get an inside story of those who have been faced with the alternative of fighting or dying. Welcome, dear guests, whom we are ready to tell what we have been doing to keep in check US imperialism and its Pentagon generals. People were being kidded along, conned, if you like, to go into a wider war. Western journalists accredited to the UN side were being lied to by the American public relations authorities. The journalists knew this, so they used to come uh, to me and ask, what did the American side propose today? What did the North Korean Chinese side propose today? I had the actual documents of what was being proposed. And very often these were completely contrary to what the journalists were being told. <laughs> On avait chargé d'apprendre à Burchette de, de traverser un peu les, les zones difficiles de la jungle pour qu'il qu puisse habituer à, à, ses, à ses marches pour, le, pour la jungle. Fond. Oui j'ai quelque chose pour toi. Regarde. Regarde là. Mais c'est pas possible. Oh là là, quelle chance. Tu vois, parce que ça, c'est le, le ministère de, de l'Information du, euh, du Front de Libération du Sud-Vietnam. Tu vas voir plein de choses. C'est une petite collection d'archives. Président N. Formidable. Les Américains se trompent en croyant qu'en bombardant le Nord, ils pourraient gagner la guerre dans le Sud. Ils comprennent que nous luttons pour euh, notre patrie. Alors, je te précise, ça n'a jamais été vu par personne, ça. C'est le laboratoire du service cinématographique du Front National de Libération. Les caméramans vietnamiens, Nguyen, ont sous la direction du journaliste australien Wilfred Burchett réalisé ce reportage. -ci.